Hayden, uh, when you look back on this season, lots of highs, lots of lows, and also a sad few farewells as well. Yeah, we, we've just spoke about it and did some presentations in the change room. We've got um, Jason Schumark, who's retired, going back to New Zealand, and then you've got Tommy Hayes, Chris Whitehead, and James Hanks, all retiring through injury, which is never nice. Um, but all four of them being fantastic servants to the club. Uh, they've been missed on and off the field, um, and we wish them all the best. For you, though, it's a lot of experience going uh, for next season, isn't it? There is, but then you look at the how many guys have played this year who stepped up from the England 20s. You know, Nolsey, Sam Hill, Slady, Dickey, all of them have come through. So um, the experience they've gained this year because they're only going to benefit us, benefit, us, benefit us next year. In terms of it, though, you've got one game to go. You want to no doubt go out on a high. Definitely. Um, you know, we, we want to finish the season well with a good performance, and it, it's a tough place to go. So we know that, and we're aware of that. We need to put in a, a top performance, better than last week probably. Um, to get you know a result that we want. In terms of it, though, there have been lots of high points. You know, especially the first end of the season, and then towards the end, the LV Cup final. Boys will take a lot of confidence from that. Definitely. I mean, I think we've we've learnt more about ourselves uh, as a side this year, and what we need, how we function than previous years. So as long as we can use that experience next year, um, I think we should be in you know real good stead for it. In a term we've been using all season, small margins. When you look at results, seven, I think of them by less than the score, it shows you're not too far off challenging with the very best in this division. No, I think, yeah, you're right. Um, we, we, if we can just turn those little little, um, little margins around, then that could be seven wins. And you know, you look at the table now, what seven or five wins would do. Um, so we, you know, we're conscious that we're working hard at that, and we're striving to get better. Um, I'm, I'm not sure we'll be able to work you know, over the summer now to get, get that right. In terms of it, you now assume the mantle of longest serving chief now with uh, Hanksy departing, but. Uh, you look around, you've got so much young talent coming through here as well. It must be a pleasure to play with those guys. It is, yeah. Um, I think they've stepped really well. Um, they're, they're really pushing. Everybody's really pushing. He's a real competitive squad. Um, and like I say, it is sad to see Hanksy go, as Tommy Hayes and, and the rest of them, Chrissy Wise here. Um, but not, not just the guys that are retiring. We've got some guys that are moving on. Um, it's sad to see them go. Um, you know, Hwani's been here since, you know, with the promotion. Um, James Phillips has been here a long time. You know, Craig Mitchell, you know, they've been fantastic servants to the club uh, on and off, off the field. And um, I hope the ones that are still playing you know, have, have real good careers and the moves are right for them. But uh, we wish them all the best. Last team run of the season, and looking around the place, it's uh, getting knocked down by the minute here. But uh, when you come back, sort of August time, uh, for, for the start of the season, it's going to be a different Sandy Park and uh, a new a new foundation again. We hope. <laughs> <laughs> no pressure on the Bills. Uh, we've got a week to play with. Um, no, it's uh, it's been strange in um, sitting in the in the meetings and hearing the uh, Jack Hammer go and you know, training on the field and everything's getting dismantled. Um, but I think it's exciting times for the club. Um, we won't be here for pre-season, obviously, because you know the, the, the site's been ripped apart and rebuilt. Um, but I mean, you know, I'm really looking forward to when we come move back in. Um, September time um, and it, you know, it's nice to be a part of it. Lots of highlights along the way this season. I imagine the LV Cup final is the one that really stands out but games against Toulon don't come every day do they? Yeah we've always really enjoyed the Heineken Cup. Um, you know big big French teams um, you know always test us. You know when Lent's doing our first one as well. These big European Cup experiences. Um, we still have the next year maybe not the Heineken Cup whatever it's called but um, um, you know, it's been a fantastic season, loads of really good memories and some good performances. I think loads for us to you know, look back on you know, and learn from. Big summer ahead for you as well, uh, off the field? Yeah, I think I'm getting, <laughs> getting married in, uh, in June, so um, yeah, a bit different when I come back. <laughs>